South Africa is not in the top 21? What? Maybe the best so far. What? Yes. Shut up. It's happening. <laughs> this universe is just starting right now. I just thought I'd show you guys my little setup here at home. Got the camera hooked up there. Got a candle to ease the nerves. Got the ring light rolling. Got the laptop set up to the TV. Got the Diet Coke. We're ready to go. I just want to say that opening number was good. I don't know what's going on, but I feel like I'm like teary eyed right now. I don't know. I'm just. Zozi is so inspirational. Wow. So we're in the first commercial break right now, and I think after this break, they're gonna go right into the top 21. And honestly, I'm just not ready. I'm not prepared mentally, physically, emotionally. So, going from 74 down to 21 in three groups of seven. Colombia is the first in the top 21, no surprise there. Peru! I really like Peru. I originally had her in my top five, and then last night I decided to take her out of my top five to swap in another girl, and I might have a regret there. France? Why was that so anticlimactic? Myanmar. Oh, it's an inspiration. Jamaica. Mexico. And she's looking, looking good tonight. Oh. DR. And no surprise. USA. Indonesia. Argentina. Okay, Argentina. Okay. India. The, <laughs> the winner on my official prediction. Yeah, okay. Curacao. Woo! Puerto Rico. In my top five picks. Welcome back. Welcome back. Philippines. Woo! All right, Philippines is in. People are happy. There's a lot of Filipino fans there. Who's next into the top 21? Brazil, of course, Brazil. Whew. That's a surprise, I think. Maybe Nicaragua. Man, there's only three spots left. Okay. Oh, that's gotta be so nerve-wracking for those girls on the stage right now. Only two spots left. Costa Rica. Wow, okay. <laughs> South Africa is not in the top 21? What? Yeah, there's no South Africa, no Nepal, no Iceland in the top 21. That, it, I feel like I'm hurt, <laughs> in a way. Swimsuit competition is up. All right, Columbia in swimsuit. Man. Okay. Peru. Yeah, Peru do be looking good tonight. Okay, yeah, Peru, Peru looks good. All right, Maria, let's see what you got. Okay. Hello, Miss France. And Myanmar looks pretty good. Wouldn't it be something if Myanmar won, though? Jamaica might be in the top five. Ooh, Mexico. She walks with purpose, holy moly. She's <laughs> popping those hips. Argentina is a curvy woman. She got that hourglass shape, boy. Okay, I see why she's in the top 21. India, my winner. India was pretty good. Curacao, Puerto Rico. She was in my top five. Estefania, maybe. Okay, Rabia. <laughs> Here comes Thailand. Wow. Maybe the best so far, honestly. Wow. <laughs> and Vietnam, the last uh, best in swim was Thailand. Honestly, Philippines is pretty good too. Maria Fatil of Australia was honestly better than I expected. And they're showing some footage from last year's crowning and it kind of like brought me chills it's like i was there i was eating doritos and i think that they're on my face 
I'm again nervous. But is India gonna be announced into the top 10? Is she not? It's Philippines. I don't know. First one in the top 10 is Jamaica. Okay. <laughs> I feel like my heart's beating really fast. DR, baby. What a nerve wracking experience this is. I'm nervous and I'm not even. <laughs> All right, it's good, it's good. My winner is still in the race. Peru, man, she does look good tonight. She's bringing her stuff. <laughs> yeah! Oh, Australia, baby, man. Okay. Oh, she's happy. I'm happy for her. Yeah, Puerto Rico. They got the whistles in the crowd. Thailand announced in the seventh spot out of the top ten. Eight, nine, ten. Only three more spots left. Oh, it's nerve wracking. Costa Rica. All right, I'm gonna be bold and say there are two spots left, and say Philippines and Mexico. There's one of them. Woo, there's one of them. All right, it's Philippines. It's gotta be Philippines. It's Philippines. It's gotta be, it's Philippines. It's Philippines. Wow. That's the top 10. <laughs> that feature on Canada. Whew. Holy moly. Myanmar won the national costume competition. Great message. So the evening gown competition is going now and Honestly, it'd be like it would be hard for these other girls. They their dreams have been kind of dashed, and now they have to like go on stage and look happy and walk around. Like I don't know, that'd be challenging. To be honest, I don't know how 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 that would feel. But anyway, here it is. The evening gown competition's live. All right, Jamaica's first out in the evening gown competition, and wow, <laughs> she's she's shiny. She's really shiny. She's Dominican Republic out now. She's shiny too. She's more of a gold shiny. She's also shiny. Shiny is the trend. Sparkly shiny. Peru. Yeah, sparkly again. Everybody's sparkly. Guess what? Australia's sparkly. Puerto Rico. In my top five. She's sparkly. <laughs> Everybody's sparkly. Wow. Guess what? Thailand's sparkly. Isn't it crazy these are, these people, they're real people, like they exist. Like they're they're humans, crazy. Costa Rica, She's sparkly. <laughs> it's the year of the sparkly dress. Mexico, she's sparkly. It's a pretty good look though. She looks happy. It's gotta be so hard to walk in those shoes. The dramatic turn. All right, Brazil, what do you got? Yeah, that's a nice dress. Holy moly, the old side slit's definitely the play is going to be the top five announcement. I think it's going to be Mexico, Puerto Rico, Australia, India, and Thailand. Okay, Mexico. Okay, she could win it, are you kidding me? Yeah. Whoa! Will, 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 Dude, mine skipped, now I'm, now I'm ahead of you. It's Wait, don't say it, don't say it, don't say it, he's gonna say it. India! <laughs> <laughs> react, but don't say who it is. God, this music gives me chills. Brazil, Brazil. Four, four girls are in. Wait, I'm missing one. It's about to be announced. Dominican Republic, Dominican Republic, what? It's one. Shut up. Ah. Is... <gasps> wow. I'm so happy for her. I'm yeah. so happy for her. Are you me kidding me? I know. Okay, I am so happy for Miss Peru. I was on the selection committee to pick her. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right, so the top five has been announced. It is Peru, India, Dominican Republic, Mexico, and Brazil. So things are getting pretty serious. There's only five women left in the competition. Wow. Kind of feel bad for Australia. I don't know. I um, Top five, they're all amazing women. Really excited to see what's going to happen next. But I'd say... Australia not making it into the top five makes me a little bit sad. Top five question and answer. The questions are submitted by the contestants. 
Mexico. Mexico, Mexico, Mexico. Mexico was in my top five. If you were the leader of your country, how would you have handled the COVID-19 pandemic? India is up. Yeah, so India did really well. I think that was a super tough question. Brazil. Brazil did pretty decent. I feel like this is a very challenging part of the competition. Dominican Republic is up now. Let's see what she has to say. Leadership to young girls is a question for Dominican Republic and it's being translated. Dominican Republic did very well. Peru is up now. Tough question from Peru. Pretty good answer. I'm confused. I'm confusion. I think, I think, I think that the top two are going to be India and Peru. I need pizza. <laughs> Time for the final statement. Mexico's up first. She's opted to speak in Spanish. She's speaking Spanish for the other thing. It's pretty good for Mexico. All right, India, my favorite to win is up. She's nervous. Free speech and the right to protest. It was good. It wasn't great. It was good. Was it good enough? I don't know. I feel nervous. Nervous. I don't like it. Mental health. <laughs> Solid from Brazil. Dominican Republic up now. Dominican Republic did really well. Last up is Peru. Climate change for, per for Peru. Peru is good. I think Peru's gonna win. <laughs> My heart still wants India. I just don't know. I, I, I think it's gonna be Peru. Oh, I'm so conflicted. I feel like Peru is gonna win, but then my heart is still with India. Oh, we're gonna find out here soon enough, aren't we? I don't want it to be over. <laughs> I don't want this to, to end. Um, and we're just minutes away from this thing being over, so. All right, time for the final look. This is one last commercial break, and then they are crowning the new Miss Universe. Again, <laughs> I feel like I'm so torn on what's gonna happen. I feel like it's gonna be Peru. Could be India still. I don't know if that's just wishful thinking at this point. What do you think is gonna happen? Yeah, um, Peru's gonna win. I think I want I want India to win. Um, yeah. That's what my heart wants. But I think it's gonna be Peru. Oh, what? It's recording, it's recording. Dominican Republic's the fourth round. My God, she is so stunning. My heart is like beating through my chest. Like I feel like I'm on stage. I know. India. Oh my God, no. India, yeah. we love you. Oh, she's so disappointed. Oh, I oh. know. Yeah. She... Oh, India, that's gotta be Peru. It's, per it's gotta be Peru, I think. Second runner-up is... What? Yeah. Shut up. Shut up! Oh. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Oh. What? So, okay, it's, so it's Mexico, two. Mexico's gonna win, I think. I don't know, though. Wait, I think Mexico's gonna win, because her first answer wasn't good, but the second one was good. What do you think? I got Mexico. <laughs> Kinda. Of. I don't know. I'm mixed. I'm happy, but I just I don't know. I feel like stunned with well, India, but mostly Peru. Oh, wow. Oh, boy, I look tired. So my camera died at a very inopportune time. Um, man, what a ride, though. Congratulations to Mi to Miss Mexico. I do not want to discount her performance or win at all. Overall, what a f what a fun night though, like what a fun ride this has been. It, I feel like almost sad that it's over. It's weird, <laughs> it's weird that, that it's, it's happened and it's in, it's in the rear view mirror now. Let us know what you think down in the comments about everything, share your insights and we always like hearing from you guys. So, okay, <laughs> until next time.